hello guys welcome to my channel and so today we are going to sew this um style with just one seam yes in the middle that is in the front line it's very easy and simple so subscribe leave a comment and share for me and so we are using this off-white um fabric we call it in ghana paradise this is different from satin it's three yards and i folded it into two so one and a half for front one and a half for back okay so we are going to measure from the end the three we are going to measure 30 inches yes and then we we'll divide the 30 into two and that's going to be 15 yes 15 then we'll move to the upper part of it so we are going to join it from that point to the 15 inches so we are cutting it like bias form yes in a bias way so from there we are ruling it straight to the 15 inches please like this video comment and subscribe for me share also as well okay so um what i did was later i reduced it so you realize that i have two lines so the second line is um 28 instead of um 30 so i reduced it to 28 and so we are going to find the middle of 28 and that's going to be 14 so you can make use of 15 which is also okay and so from the um 28 line we are going to measure 16 you can measure 15 14 or however you want it but don't let it go up too much okay so 16 is what i measured and we are going to curve it from that point to the 14 inches that we measured please subscribe if you have not yet subscribed like and share this video comment for me okay so this is it we have kept it to the 14 we'll move to the upper part of it and we are going to measure our back neck so that place is going to be our back neck and we are measuring the width to be three inches and then we are going to measure the neck deep that is one and a half inch and i'm going to join it with my curve yes going to join it okay then we'll move to the uh, other side of the upper part yes where we did the bias line we are also going to measure our front neck width and the front neck to the width is three inches just as the back and then the depth i'm going to measure nine inches you can measure seven eight however you want it so i measured nine and i'm going to join it to that line the point the three inches point okay so the next thing we are going to do is to cut it so this is the whole thing we are done with the measurement and the next thing is to just go ahead and what and cut it out so we'll first cut the neck the, the back neck yes then we'll move straight to the down and go and cut the curved line straight to the front neck and please when you subscribe don't forget to click on the notification bell it helps so that whenever i upload a new video you'll be notified a lot of you have subscribed but because you have not clicked on the notification bell when i upload a new video you are not aware and so you might think we are not uploading videos but we are and so click on the notification bell and select all select all so that every video you will get notification and so you are going to cut the front neck to off yes okay and so the next thing you are going to do is to sew the that part yes you are going to sew it and so what we'll do now is to pin it we'll pin that area we'll sew on a half inch so you have to pin it so that we can do the next um, part also so we are going to open it up so that we'll get the front and back very well yes so open it this way and so you see this is it the front and so you can see that and uh, so this is the down part that's how it looks 
and so with the upper part the neck you see that it we have excess the front one is higher than it so we have turned it to the back and we are going to cut that excess we see there we are going to cut it and after cutting it you are going to create a new neck um line for the front one yes so we have to cut that excess so that we can easily create a new neckline yes okay so open it up and join it like the first one and then measure the neck width for the front which is three inches yes and then measure our nine inches neck deep and then after we are going to join it with um the ruler mm -hmm. okay and then we are going to cut it yes okay so this is it after we turn it to the right position and you see the front neck coming out well so we are going to sew the shoulder but we'll measure where our hand will pass that is the sleeve and i measured eight inches so you can measure your sleeve width and then you place it there so another eight inches so we'll sew from the shoulder to the eight inch point on both sides now at the neck area you can choose to fold it this way and then sew on top you can choose to do it this way and sew on top all over and do the same thing that back to you can also do it the same then you sew then you join the middle part you can also use lighter to finish the end so you wouldn't have to sew the down part you can also decide to fold it that way and then sew on top and then after you join the middle but i'm going to cut facing for the front i'm going to cut facing for the front yes as I said, you can also use lighter to finish the ends or you can also decide to knit it. Either you knit it or you overlock it however you want it. So I'm measuring four for the facing width. Yes. And I'm going to join it to the length of the facing and I'm going to cut it out. Please share this video for me. Subscribe and leave a comment as well and try the style and very simple within some few minutes you'll be done so after i'll just at the front part of the dress i'll face the facing with it the right part of it and sew on top this way then after i will turn it this way and give it a top stitch and do the same thing for the other side so i'll do that before i will join the middle do you get it yes before i'll join the middle what i'm going to do is i'm going to cut the facing again so that that place will be a bit wider and then i'll do that join it so this is it i have done all that and i've added my facing join the shoulders and all that so you see my front neck come it came out very well you see and this is the middle after i joined it mm -hmm. now with the neck i just the back neck i just knit it i did not fold on top and so i just knit it this is the sleeve side also i knitted it same way and then the other side also i knitted it and then the down part also i just knit just did some knitting also there and that was it yes so i'm going to put this on a mannequin for you to see the end result yes and so this is very simple just get a very relaxing three yards fabric and you are good to go and you are going to love the style where it's at any occasion and it fits yes so let's see on the mannequin this is it the end result of our one seam uh trending kaftan or boo boo 
whatever name you call it this is it thanks for watching share this video have a blessed day bye bye <music>